Welcome to the World Register Report. The World Register is an independent news source providing truthful, unbiased, and timely reporting of people, places, and events. Commentaries are also provided on selected stories from time to time. As reported by the Associated Press today, U.S. President Donald Trump met with German Chancellor Angela Merkel at the White House. The AP reports that discussions will involve NATO, Islamic State, and the Ukraine. President Trump offered a bit of levity, saying to journalists, send a good picture back to Germany, please. Although Chancellor Merkel shared similar ideologies with former U.S. President Barack Obama, President Trump has been a critic of her policies that included allowing large amounts of unvetted refugees into her country. Some European countries were forced to build walls and turn back refugees traveling through Europe to Germany. Many refugees are young men of military age from the Middle East and Africa. Even though President Trump was quick to speak of what he felt were bad choices made by Chancellor Merkel, it is expected he will strike a conciliatory and diplomatic tone during their visit. The Associated Press reports today that Syria fired missiles at Israeli combat aircraft soon after Israel struck targets inside Syria. After the Israeli jets hit Syrian targets and returned to their airspace, Syria launched several missiles at the aircraft. Israel issued a statement saying they intercepted one missile and no damage was incurred on any of their aircraft or territory. Israeli Channel 10 TV said the missile was shot down using the aero defense system. However, Syria claims it shot down one of the aircraft and damaged another, according to the AP report. In letters sent to the United Nations from the foreign ministry in Syria, officials stated the Security Council should, quote, condemn the blatant Israeli aggression that is considered a violation of international law. Channel 10 said the aircraft were on a mission to destroy a weapons convoy destined for a Lebanese Hezbollah group. As reported by Reuters News Agency today, Al-Qaeda endorsed the merger of Mali's main militant groups and encouraged the unification of others. Various groups have attacked Malian, French, and UN peacekeeping forces in the region. In 2013, French troops and UN peacekeepers were sent to Mali after the vast northern desert was invaded by the militants. However, the militants are still able to use the desert as a base and attack neighboring countries. That's it for now. Make sure that you do check out those links, and as always, subscribe, like, and comment below.